Hey everybody, hey, it's Mitch Grooms again from YouTube. We're going to do some maintenance, maintenance again on this 98 XJR supercharged version. And it's a showroom condition car with 70,000 miles. From the factory, it came with 370 horsepower. Uh, it hits zero to 60 in five seconds. The car is, uh, is very, very fast. All right, here we go. This is just maintenance. The car is running perfectly, so I always, you know, I change the I change the oil every 1,500 miles. You know, you can eat off this engine. It's spotless. Uh, what we're gonna do today is remove air box, change out the air filter. We're going to clean the mass airflow sensor, and this little thing right here is very very important to your car. Your car will not run with it without it. If it's dirty, it will not run good. It will skip. It will it will start you know throwing you codes it won't, it won't start very very crucial to your car what we're going to do is remove this and what you're going to need for this job is compressed air i'm going to use this you don't have to have it but i am now again i'm going to say this a couple times only use this mass airflow sensor cleaner on the it's called an maf mass airflow do not use anything else i repeat do not use anything else or you will really mess up your car this does not keep does not uh, leave residue drives quickly only use this only again i'll rephrase that use this only all right Go with that five sixteenth five sixteenth socket 10 metric socket screwdriver here's a filter that you'll be using it's called a man filter <laughs> what a name the part number is c31130 this this part only cost 19 dollars and i got it off ebay and i got this thing in three days they're under the name parts container on ebay you should also go to newparts.com and uh i actually got this thing in three days three days amazing all right, so let's have some little fun. Again, this is just maintenance, and uh, my word is if I can do it, you definitely can do this. So let's go for it. All right, first thing you do, uh, this pipe is new. If you have an original pipe, you will probably break this. So everything on this car has been replaced. So you've got two tabs on both sides right here. You're going to press down both sides hard. If you can't do it, you have to use a wrench or something. Press down hard, and it will pop right off. Very easy. All right, next thing you're going to do is remove the wiring harness from the massive airflow sensor and make sure that you, whatever you do, do not clean this, even if you could, with it connected, you really mess it up. There's two tabs, press down, and it comes right off just like that next thing you do everybody listen to this so listen to this right here slide it up we're getting ready to take this off now you will have if you have the jaguar xgr you will have this right here that is a 10 metric since mine is broken right here it's going to come right off but you would have to just screw this off but in this situation it comes right off now it should come right out. So it should. There we go. All right. What we're going to do next four tabs. We got one, two. Three, four. Let's come right off. Oop, five. Excuse me. Five. Right. See the difference? Definitely need cleaning. All right, go side. 
We have a lot, a lot of trash in this. All right, since I didn't get that in the video, let's try this again. <laughs> new, old, old, new. Now that we got it, all right. All right, the next thing, this only fits one way. One way only. That's done. Now here we go with the mass airflow sensor. You have three screws. One, two, three. This only fits one way. You cannot mess this up. If I can't mess it up, you can't mess it up. One, two, three. Now let's go ahead and take this off and let's clean this. All right, here we go. The mass airflow sensor is different on different cars. The XJR uses one, it's one unit. Uh, the XJ8s usually use, this as one unit, this is one unit, but this is one unit only. They do not come apart. And these range around $95 to $300 on eBay. If you get one of these, make sure you get OEM, uh, factory part do not get one from China this is extremely important to your car do not get one made from China or when they knock off brands you'll be wasting your time all right I'll throw it off here is the make number if you can see it let's see there you go now we'll post this in the uh, description all right, so what we're going to do, we're going to clean it. You got the wires right inside there. So let's uh, let's get another angle here. All right, I'm going to try to get a shot of this if I can. Let's see right here. There's a wire right inside there. Hope you can see it. But whatever. Uh, there it is. Well, doing the best I can. So that wire is very sensitive. What you do is don't ever touch it. In this situation, you can't because this is one unit. Now, the ones that do come with two units, this actually will come out as one unit and it bolts up with two screws. This situation, this does not. This is a one unit. So how many times am I going to say that? So what we're going to do, master flow sensor, remember, only use this. All right, there you go. Let it drain out. Let it drain out. And what you want to do is let this thing dry, air dry like 10 or 15 minutes before you put it back in. This dries very, very quickly, but make sure it's totally dry before installing it. All right, next step. Before we go further, I'm gonna show you the part number for the masseur. It's LNC162 AA. That is the part number. All right. All right, let's get this thing together. I wanted to add that on my channel, I'm a Jag enthusiast. I love these cars. If you keep these cars maintained, um, it, they'll run forever. But you do all have to do some other things like the between 90, 98 to 2003 what's well, actually 98 to 2001 these XJRs XJ8s it's called a X308 is the body style and then the engine, the engine is a AJ26 these cars had failures on the timing chain tensioners and guides they were made of bad plastic so I had mine replaced you can also go to my channel and you can see the replacement everything on this car has been replaced also what I'm sitting on right now this is a 1981 special edition turbo Trans Am so you might want to see that on my channel too all right don't over torque this stuff all right all right we're back this goes one way. You cannot mess it up. I could even mess it up. So, 
field. One, two, three, four, last one. Five. All right, it's ready to go back on the car. Hey, before I put this on, I want two things uh, to let you know, just to be aware of. You have two places right here, all right? What you do is you turn this thing upside down. Keep in mind, these go in the spots. So if it's off, uh, this is the reason why you can't get it uh, seated down correctly. Make sure these are in spot. This right here, all right? Another thing is, this right here, the end of it. This goes into here, right there. So this rubber thing, I call it a rubber thing. I don't know what the real name of the cord is. Goes around here, and then this goes through there. All right. One other note. Um, I'm very cautious because I, I seem to break things when I fix things. So I don't want to break. I want to fix. I always cover the pipe up because you don't want trash to get in here and go into the, the flow of the air. All right. You want to keep this closed off until you're ready to install. Might take a little time. Make sure you pull up the wire, you don't get it stuck underneath. This one there. Go underneath, make sure those tabs are correctly installed. They are. Hook up the massive flare sensor. Snap, new pipe, snap, well I gotta get my screwdriver, all right we're back, screwdriver, make sure this is pulled tight, we should be good to go. So guys, I really want to say thank you for allowing me to have fun with you today. Tight, tight, on, tight. There you go. You don't want dirt to get past this pipe to go to the throttle body. The throttle body is right, I can't see, right there. Another crucial part right here. Do not get dirt sucked into this. I want to thank you guys and everybody for watching my video today. Next thing we're going to do is going to remove these struts. They're gone. That'd be like a two minute video. But again, thank you again. Please subscribe. Please like. Please dislike. You know, I, I like criticism too. That's fine. Uh, I always say, if I can do a job, you can do a job. Thanks again. We appreciate you.